today on MTG Unpacked, it's time for another Commander Snack. So the Commander today is not the Locust God, but in fact a very strange creature indeed. We have Arix Methy's Slumbering Isle, so that's boosts the lighting a tad there. Legendary Creature Kraken, 12-12 for 4. Craziness, the Enters Battlefield tapped with five slumber counters on it. As long as has Rick Smethies has a slumber counter on it, it's a land. It's not a creature. Whenever you cast a spell, you may remove a slumber counter from Rick Smethies. Tap, you can add green and blue to your mana pool. And so this is going to be rather tough. We're going to be looking for Krakens today. And there aren't actually that many Krakens in Magic. I think there are only about 15 or so from when I checked Scryfall earlier. And later in the video, we're gonna take a look at some mail from Chuckwagon MTG, so stay tuned for that. And the patron today is Andrew B. Thank you for being a patron. I wish I had a Kraken or Sea Creature background there, but this was the best I could do. Probably the bluest playmat I have. All right, let's get into it, Theros Beyond Death. So, believe it or not, there is a Kraken in here. And the patrons get the rares, mythics, foils, and anything over a buck. So, let's get started. We have Portent of Betrayal, Sunman Pegasus, Omen of the Hunt, Discordant Piper, and that is how I play the flute. Rather disturbing, using my nose. Wings of Hubris, Flicker of Fate, Thirst for Meaning. There we go, there's a C card. You know what, let's chuck that in as well. Uh, let's read it first. Instant for three, draw three cards, then discard two cards unless you discard an enchantment card. So how about that? We'll be looking for, let me just quickly double check, looking for things with the C in there, okay. Funeral Rites, Eidolon of Philosophy, Dreadful Apathy. An uncommon staggering insight. Siona, captain of the Paleas. Hateful Eidolon. And the rare is Protean Thaumaturge. Creature, human, wizard, 1 1 for 2. With constellation, whenever an enchantment enters the battlefield under your control, you may have Protean Thaumaturge. Become a copy of another target creature, except it has this ability. And an island. And you know what? I'm going to chuck in islands. And a goat token! Yes, you need a goat because everybody gets a goat. All right. Next up, Born of the Gods. So there is, uh, I think there's a couple of Krakens in this set, or maybe that was Theros. So, fingers crossed, we have Revoke Existence, Scaring Sands, Charging Badger! Watch out for that thing. Flood Tide Serpent, here we go, close enough to a Kraken. Creature Serpent 4-4 four, four for 5, Flood Tide Serpent can't attack unless you return an enchantment you control to its owner's hand. Okay, pop him over there. Fellhide Brawler, Reckless Reveler, Snake of the Golden Grove, Nullify, Cyclops of One-Eyed Pass, Necrobite, and Uncommons. Ah, a C theme here, Kiora's Follower, 2-2 two, two for 2, tap, you get to untap another target permanent. She may call herself Kiora, but I believe she is Thassa, the embodiment of the sea and empress of the depths. Thunderous Smite. Raised by wolves. And the rare is Felhide Spirit Binder. Creature Minotaur Shaman 344 with Inspired. Whenever Felhide Spirit Binder becomes untapped, you may pay one in a red if you do. Put a token onto Vodafield that's a copy of another target creature, except it's an enchantment in addition to its other types. It gains haste, exile at the beginning of the next end step. Alright, and a forest and an elemental token. That's actually pretty cool. Have not seen that guy before. Okay, Theros Beyond Death. Let's go. Let's get some Krakens here, people. Or maybe those tentacle tokens, that'd be good as well. Sunman Pegasus. Nyxborn Seaguard, Enchantment Creature, Merfolk Soldier, 2-5 for 4, I guess we're checking in Merfolk as well. Thrill of Possibility, Relentless Pursuit, Nyxborn Marauder, Farika's Libation, Hyrax Tower Scout, 
Wings of Hubris, Flicker of Fate, Thirst for Meaning, you get another one, there we go. Uncommons, Illyrius Enraptured, Escape Velocity, Daxus Blessed by the Sun, and rare is Temple of Abandon, enters Vatifield tapped. When it enters Vatifield, scry one, you can tap it for red or green. Alright, not bad, a Forest and Satyr token. Okay, so halfway through, Theros. I would settle for a god pool here, I think. That would be just fine. We have Nessian Asp, Viper's Kiss. What's with all the snakes today? Dragon Mantle, Omen Speaker, Boulder Fall, Savage Surge, Asphodel Wanderer, Voyaging Satyr, Titan Strength, Baleful Eidolon, and Uncommon's Phalanx Leader, Ordeal of Perforos, Ordeal of Nylea, and yes, ding 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 ding, it's a mythic! Elspeth, Sun's Champion, fantastic pull. Planeswalker Elspeth, four loyalty for six, her plus one. Put three, one one white soldier creature tokens onto battlefield, minus three, destroy all creatures with power four or greater. Minus seven, you get an emblem with creatures you control, have plus two, plus two, and have flying. Very happy about that one, and a mountain, and this guy with so many arms, you just can't believe it. Okay, Born of the Gods. Hoping for a god pull in this pack, or a Kraken, or preferably both. We have Epiphany Storm, Servant of Timoret, Great Heart, Satyr Wayfinder, Retraction Helix, Ferris Band Trumper, Deep Water Hypnotist! Creature Merfolk Wizard 2142 has inspired whenever Deep Water Hypnotist becomes untapped. Target creature and opponent controls gets minus three, minus zero until end of turn. Crypsis, Reckless Reveler, Grizzly Transformation, Uncommon Satya Nick Smith, Unravel the Aether, God Favored General, and rare is Fated Infatuation, Instant for three. Put a token onto the battlefield, that's a copy of target creature you control. If it's your turn, scry two. Alright, and a mountain and gold token. Alright, Theros Beyond Death, rounding things out here. And then we'll take a look at that mail from the Chuck Wagon. I'm one of his patrons. Very happy with it. Okay, Naiad of Hidden Coves. And yes, I see water, enchantment creature nymph. 2, 3, for 3, as long as it's not your turn, suppose you cast, cost 1 less to cast. Underworld Rage Hound, Heliod's Pilgrim, Omen of the Hunt, Omen of the Dead, Maya's Grasp, Rumbling Sentry, Witness of Tomorrow's, Elysian Carrioted, Towering Wave Mystic, Creature Merfolk Wizard 2, 1, for 2, Whenever Towering Wave Mystic deals damage, target player puts that many cards from the top of their library into their graveyard. Some nice milling action there. Phalanx Tactics for the Uncommons, Medoma's Prophecy, Nessian Horn Beetle, and rare is Erebos's, <coughs> excuse me, Erebos's Intervention. Instant for X and a black. Choose one. Target creature gets minus X, minus X until end of turn. You gain X life. Exile up to twice X target cards from graveyards. And another island, I'll chuck that in as well, and a human soldier. Okay, so we did not find any other Krakens, but did get a nice variety of merfolk and other blue cards, and a goat, of course. I had to chuck the goat in. Oh, and we also pulled an Elspeth, so I don't think we can complain too much today. So there we go, Andrew, thank you very much. We'll tuck that in there and stay tuned for the patron snap packs later in the month. Okay, Chuck Wagon, what do we got here? Digging in, and if you have not checked out Chuck Wagon MTG's YouTube channel, I'll pop a link up in the corner there. I'll also leave a link in the description for this video. Uh, he does all sorts of pack cracking and deck techs and all sorts of other goodness. Okay, let's dig in here. Alright. So what do we have here? Thank you, it's been an amazing journey. Oh, he's taking a break. All right. Everyone could use a little more magic in their lives. Yes, thank you, Chuckwagon MTG. Okay, so he still has plenty of cool content to check out. 
So take a look at that while he's having a break. Hopefully he'll be back sooner rather than later. Okay, so see if I can get into here without doing myself an injury with a sharp implement. And I think, yes, the famous packing, here we go. We'll get there eventually. Hopefully you fast forwarded through this bit. Or maybe it was amusing to watch me struggle. Okay, what do we have? Let's dig in. Okay, so let's uh, take a look here. So we've got a couple of cards in this packet. Looks like a foil. So oh, put that back there. All right, so we get a foil planes. Pretty tasty. And Pit Keeper, another foil. Very nice artwork on that one. What is that from Modern Masters 2017? Alright. Pop him over there and let's go through the rest. What else do we have? We've got a oh a foil walking corpse. Foul Mayanite. Liturgy of Blood. Some cool artwork on that one. Wall of Mist. Gearsmith Prodigy. Skyreach Manta. Creature Fish, that's on the theme today. Tormenting Voice. Trusted Pegasus. Teferi's Time Twist. Golden Egg. Essence Drain. Ooh, that's pretty cool. I don't think I've ever seen that before. What is that, M13? Very nice. Reflector Mage. And a rare Creeper Hulk. What on earth? Creature Plant Elemental 555. We trample one and green until end of turn. Target creature you control is base power and toughness 55 and gains trample. We've got another rare here. Elspeth Conquers Death. As a Sargrant is an after your draw step, add a Law Counter Sucker after three. So turn one, next old target opponent or oh, target permanent an opponent controls. With converted mana cost 3 or greater, turn 2 non-creature spells your opponent's cast costs 2 more to cast until your next turn. Turn 3, return target creature or planeswalker card from your graveyard to the battlefield. Put a plus 1 plus 1 counter on it, or a loyalty counter on it. Nylea's Intervention, sorcery for X and 2 greens. Choose one, search your library for up to X land cards, reveal them, put them into your hand and shuffle your library, or it deals twice X damage to each creature with flying. And yet another rare, holy moly, Cabal Stronghold. So land from Dominaria, tap, add colors mana, pay three, tap, add a black for each basic swamp you control. Okay, so some nice pulls there from Chuckwagon MTG. Thank you very much, sir. And leave a note in the comments. If you watch this far, what is your favorite Kraken in the game of Magic? I know there aren't that many. So I'm curious which one you think is the best. And I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up. Hit the subscribe button for more Magic Gathering unboxings and be sure to tap the notification bell to be notified as soon as new videos are released. Thanks for watching and have a great day.